The spatial effects. Oh my god. Listen. You need songs like this. I love it. Celebration indeed of being alive. We all need to do it from time to time. Because we forget about it. I noticed uh, a lot of these songs are much longer than you'd expect from this genre, with all due respect. You expect like three minute songs, but these are like five minutes, seven minutes. Nice. This is something different. Ooh, how, how organic does this song feel in context of the album? Jesus Christ. Great. Absolutely amazing. Yo, this is, this is a great song to ride a bike to, to drive around with your windows down. It's the ultimate chill out song. Coming back a bit more to the bittersweet. Huge chorus. Disgusting. Man, I love this trend in 2021 to put bass in the foreground. It's what you have to do. Sometimes, not all the time. <laughs> okay. Getting into the territory of like ambient rock, that guitar is nice. Jeez. This is fantastic. Oh, the contrast. Everything. It's everything. This is better than Post Malone in circles. <laughs> Ooh. Got some screams on this album, okay. He's a capable vocalist, I mean, so. Damn. Damn. That is, that is great. Wow, what an end. Now this might be my favorite song of the album. This was fantastic. This feels nostalgic. It's got that vibe to it, you know? Early 2000s rock. Anyone? Me? Ooh. This is a sweet song. Big chorus. Ooh. Chopping it up a little bit, okay. <laughs> This one's heart-wrenching, soul-tearing, emotional track. Jesus Christ! 
Did not expect that note to be hit there. But okay. What a beautiful send off and it, and the album did end with the piano like I hoped for. Damn.